another Marshy's Gaming video. And today we are going to see how to make a wither. All you need are is a few blocks of soul sand and three wither skeleton skulls. Actually, four soul sands and three wither skeleton skulls. Once you have all of that, place them in a T form. And on top, place three wither skulls. Once that is ready, it'll pop up. And at the top of your screen, you'll have a little thing of its health bar saying wither and that will be what its health is and once you put it in all of your mobs will probably start attacking it like pigmen ravengers but the uh wither will kill them and you might have no mobs or your villages could look like this and that's just the beginning and don't get me started on five of them as at once just going to change to clear weather so that we can all see weather. that this what four, what five look like So, one, two, okay, well, I'm just going to go over here and put another one. It can get hard building a second one when you already have a wither in your world, so try to do all five of them at the same time, and don't do what I just did. And three, four withers, and five. And now there's six withers in my world. And Endermen will attack them. If you get a wither down to half health, then like Enderman will actually start killing it for you, which I think is pretty helpful. And don't like place them anywhere near like your great buildings. Uh, otherwise, let's say I just put this down and it would destroy that little camp fire and camp set I have around it, which it's pretty fun to watch it, but don't like put it by your house because that would be your house once you're done. And nobody wants no house because if you're in survival, you're gonna have to feel wither and build another house and you might have some lava so don't put them like right next to your favorite house or things that you made in the past that are pretty special to you like I know one of my videos was on how to make a slime elevator well, I'm not going to put it next to my slime elevator because I like that personally just standing right there. I mean, it's perfectly fine. It's not bothering anything. So, like, if you put this next to this beacon, you would not get it back. So, probably don't put a wither next to beacons or, like, castles because then you got whatever this is I don't know what that is and then you also got these and these 
have some fire. If you have fire spreads and the I'm just not going I'm not going to talk. I'm just going run away. Or fly away. Like that wither. He's just flying. But that is pretty much it for how to build a wither and Marsh is out.